Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Ben and I'm bringing you all the confirmed Black Ops 2 multiplayer weapons that will be in the game. So now let's start things off with the primary weapons which consist of assault rifles, SMGs, snipers, LMGs and shotguns. So in the assault rifles category we have the AN94, the SMR, the M8A1, the Type 25, the SA58, the SIG 556, SCAR H and the TAR 21, the last two of which we have of course seen in previous Call of Duty games. And now moving on to the SMGs and first of all the MP7 which I'm super excited about seeing back in Black Ops 2 after we saw it in Modern Warfare 3 and I loved it to be honest, it's one of my favourite weapons. Um, so I'm glad that's back in, the Chicom QCB is also in there along with the PDW57, the Scorpion, the MSMC and the Vector K10. I'm moving on to the least used group of weapons, I would guess, uh, the LMGs, which are the LSAT, uh, the QBB LSW, and the MK48. And so now moving on to the snipers, and actually for the first time since I think it was COD 5, uh, you can actually just use an iron sight on the sniper instead of just um, one of the scopes that we've been used to in the last three or four Call of Duty games. So you can actually have an attachment to just have an iron sight on, which is pretty cool because they were pretty good in uh, COD 5. So the snipers, we have the DSR-50, the SVU-AS and the Ballista. And for any quick scopers out there, it does look like quick scoping is going to be in the game, but you're going to have to be pretty good at it. Um, it's going to be a bit like the first Black Ops, where you can quick scope, but you're going to need a little bit more skill than you do in the Modern Warfare games. But swiftly moving on to the shotguns, which are the M1216, uh, the Sega 12, and the R870 MCS. And that is the end of the primary weapons, and uh, all of those weapons that I've just mentioned we have seen in gameplay or trailers um, released by Treyarch, and so those were the images on the side of the uh, the screen. And there probably will be a couple of guns uh, added to these lists, especially the shotguns, that list seems a little bit shorter than usual, um, but we're probably going to have to wait until the game's released on November 13th to find out those weapons. And before moving on to the secondary weapons, I'd just like to give you a quick look at the attachments that you can have on uh, the assault rifles, so it gives you a kind of idea of what kind of attachments we're going to be having in this game. The ones that stand out are the target finder and uh, the select fire option which is the first time ever we've been able to select um, different rates of fire between single, three round burst and automatic mode and that can be attached onto any assault rifle to give it loads more diversity in ranges of fire and loads of cool stuff like that so can't wait to have a go with that. And uh, so it's now probably time to go on to the secondary weapons. And in this category we have the uh, pistols and the launchers and in the pistols category we have the executioner, the TAC 45, CAP 40 and the B23R which I'm told is a bit like the Rafikas. And uh, here is all the attachments that you can put on your pistol uh, to make it better. The only real new one there is the laser sight which gives you better accuracy from the hip fire uh, so that should be interesting to use. But swiftly moving on to the launchers which are the RPG. Uh, the small and the FJH 18AA, which looks really cool to be honest. Um, and finally, we're moving on to the lethal kind of section. I would have called it lethal grenades, but they're not really all grenades, are they? To be honest. Um, so yeah, we've got kind of the standard, apart from of course the uh, combat axe, which is just another name for a tomahawk, really. So. That doesn't really count as anything new, does it? But don't go yet. If you're yet to find out the kill streaks, the maps, the creator class setup, and many more information things on uh, Black Ops 2, then go on my channel right now. It's all on there. And uh, also the links on the screen right now, the images, click on them, and they will take you take you to the respective videos. So um, thank you for watching this. Uh, quick like is really appreciated. I mean, it takes one second to like it. It took me a few hours to make this. So. Um, that's all I ask from you. Subscribe for more Black Ops 2 news if you haven't already. And thank you for watching, guys. Have a nice day.